Can I have some money? Damn. How much you need? Whatever you feel like giving, kind sir. <laughs> the fact that I don't like when a woman see. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, welcome to the channel. Before we start watching this video, I want to say thank you for all the love and support. Now, you guys just saw what happened. Who would take this woman serious? Let's keep watching to see what what's going to happen next. Like the fact that I put out like, the stack like that, and I knew to bring this shit because I know, like, the, now I know, I like, a man that provides that's yeah, his pride in being a provider. Like, you feel me? This is natural, though. Yeah, but I gotta but I'm make sure. this just for bait to see, like, who would jump out of line and just, like, skip every round just to run to the bag. We got more money. They probably just was like, nah. Cause the money come with some genuine shit. You get I mean, more when you're genuine, genuine though. I'm a genuine person. But the fact that you got out of line. We gonna, we gonna be no, no, no. Day. The fact that you got out of line and ran up to that. She did. Damn, that's a no. Like, I at the end of the day, it's still everybody want money at the end of the day. I get me. I want money. Wait, 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 wait. I want money. I want money too. You can't get it. Damn. I'ma put this in your hands, bro. I ain't really gonna fuck with it right now. Like, yeah. I'm already yeah, yeah. on payroll. No, I ain't even on that. I need a man that takes pride in being a provider. We're here to compete for you and to see if you're a good match for me. A good match for me is a man that takes pride in being a provider. So that's why I asked you that, really, just to see what you was going to say. I know baby girl in the blue, and she ran from way the fuck over there. And she like, she left, bro. She left? After you put the money back in, she left. It's crazy. Nowadays, a lot of women, I'm not going to say all, a lot of women, they are not looking for love. They are looking for somebody to take care of them. Take care of them if you have money forget about love that's how that's how i see it that's how a lot of them they don't care about none of these things as long as you have money for some that's all that matters but make sure you guys comment down below what you think about this you are broke you should not be dating i'm not saying if you're broke you're not worthy of love and happiness you're just not worthy of me i'm just kidding you need to focus on yourself broke guys are usually the most insecure guys on the planet. I swear to God. It's not necessarily their fault at all. Because as a society, we have prided men and we have made their self-worth contingent on how much money they make or their profession. The broke men, they just, they walk around with a chip on their shoulder. If you don't like your circumstances, try to do something about it. Don't be mad at everyone else. Especially not me. What the f What did I do? I can't agree with um with with some of what she said. If you if you don't have any money, I don't think she should be worrying about getting a, into a relationship or chasing women. I think you should work on yourself, get some money. But she said broke people shouldn't be dating, right? But if 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 we said broke people shouldn't be dating, right? A lot of women shouldn't be dating because a lot of dating show when you're watching them the first thing that they ask is how much money you're making what is it that you're doing that's all they care about so if only broke people shouldn't be dating but a lot of women shouldn't be dating that's just my opinion what do you guys think as soon as they say hey beautiful i want you to reply cash app hey beautiful paypal hey beautiful zell these bum men are telling women that they lose value with time so if that is true i want you to be more direct and the only people that are going to be offended are the men that come from the mountain of dust the dusty bums are going to be highly upset you're a gold digger yes i am do you have a mountain of gold for me to dig if not move out the way so i can see the man behind you shining Oh, you're materialistic. No, I'm not. You said that women lose value with time, so I don't have time to waste on your bum self. Hey, beautiful cash app. Hey, beautiful international wire. Hey, beautiful bank transfer. Hey, beautiful Bitcoin. Hey, beautiful PayPal. This be he's talking that he's talking like he's spitting facts. I hope any women watching this man right here do not take his advice. There's no way a man going to approach you and then he simply say, hey, how are you? And in the second, the, your answer is cash up, send me some money, your bank statement, all this nonsense. What, what exactly do you think this man going to do? He's going to run and probably going to just stop talking to you completely.
so at the end of the day we all gotta eat so if you guys don't see what this man is doing i don't know what else to say but let's keep watching how much money should a man have before he gets into a relationship at minimum a man should have three hundred thousand us dollars in a savings account before we keep watching this video right three before you start dating you gotta have at least three hundred thousand dollars in your bank account so based on this video do you guys honestly think this man right here that we are watching do you think he has this amount of money in his in his bank account i think this man probably he just talking to make women feel good about themselves make them feel good this is what you should expect from a man if you want to date that man three hundred thousand dollars let's keep watching Fifty thousand of that goes to your new bride. Before y'all get married here, I love you. His fifty thousand. The other fifty thousand go on a deposit of your new family house. Another fifty thousand furnishes that new family house. Another fifty thousand you should be able to live off for the first six months of your new marriage. And another hundred thousand goes into your savings account for business expenses, emergencies, um, so have you. But if you really want to step into the real leagues when men are handling their business, you should have at least one million to three million in your savings account before you even entertain a woman period it's time for us to lead by example men we are maintainers and protectors of our women on each and every level mentally physically spiritually financially and emotionally <laughs> <laughs> you guys you, you you saw this live right here you, you see this right here he knows that he's all he's saying is bullshit. <laughs> There's no way. There's no way this guy probably have this amount of money. But you know, women love to hear those kind of stuff, right? I'm pretty sure people watching his channel probably women, and now they probably hearing this. They say probably gonna say yes, King. This is the kind of man that we want. But this is not reality. This man selling women a dream. At the end of the day, we all gotta eat. So make sure you guys comment down below what you think about this. You want to get married, right? Mm. Do you think you guys need to lose how much? Yeah. That's like tell no. yourself. Oh. I don't think what I earn is your business. You are a man. No. So what you understand? What so, should so, be your business as well. No, it should be my business because you have to take care of me. So what do you mean? Like if I'm if I'm concerned about how much you earn? Yeah, then you are not a man. Planning, then I'm not a man. Yeah, exactly. Because as why as should you be? Let me tell you, yeah, women. Do, listen, 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 listen. Killed, yeah. If I love you as a man, yeah. you don't need to ask me. I can buy you gifts. I can surprise you, but you don't have to ask for it. I want to know how much I have. Well, I don't see the problem with this. If you're in a relationship with somebody before you guys get into before you guys get married or get do anything important i think i don't see why you guys shouldn't let each other know this is how much i'm making this is how much you're making so we can see what we can what we can do before we start doing anything what do you guys think how long have you guys been together <laughs> uh, about six months that's it it's new oh it's newish we're friends <laughs> this is crazy this man probably was thinking yes i have a girlfriend he probably takes um this woman out the whole time in his head he probably is thinking that he has a girlfriend but she's not thinking the same thing she probably like this is the man that can feed me so you know i'm gonna take advantage of it but let's keep watching we're just friends but he wants to can we talk about this uh not in front of everyone <laughs> I don't see how is that funny women like this going to turn this man into a master now you use that guy and then he said he was thinking that you were his girlfriend and but the whole time you guys were not on the same page he's not going to be the same after this did you know that when your girlfriend is confident enough to fight in your presence it is love research has shown that when she does that she is sure of a laugh for you and yours for her so the next time she farts in your presence smile inhale and say i love you so i'm guessing nowadays there's a research for everything i hope any women watching this video do not take advice from these women this is nasty so how many of you guys if your women do this thing in front of you this is this is going to be a reaction this woman she is nasty but if 
that's how she thinks a man going to stay with her then i wish you all the best you're gonna be single probably for the rest of her life men are so jealous of women especially beautiful women and the root of all of that anger and all of that jealousy is the patriarchy which is guess what set up by men <laughs> I don't know what kind of man she is talking about, but I'm gonna leave that up to you guys. So make sure you guys comment down below what you think about this. As always, I do appreciate each and every one of you guys for taking the time to watch your video. If you are new here, once again, welcome to the channel. And before you leave, don't forget to show some love to the channel by hitting the like and the sub button if you haven't done so already. Hey, listen, I'm out.